Mathieu de Klerk. I'm here today. A.A. Ron. A.A. Ron. Thank you very much. Yeah. We are here today. You're in the Hippo Studios. I'm in the uh, Ulterior, Universe, Ulterior Universe Studios where I'm surrounded by the grand tour of Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. And uh, I am uh, talking about, yeah. however, this aside, I don't know what I'm even talking about. <laughs> the yeah. EP Monthly from March 2019. You just want to show article. off your new poster Woo! holder. That's yeah, I probably kind of do. Look at me. Yes. Can you say tangent? The, uh, the article we're going to talk about today is Blood Gases, ABG versus VBG. And I just told you, I kind of skimmed this one because I was going to come back to it because I think yeah, I already know everything. Yeah, because I know why you skimmed it, Aaron, because yeah. when was the last time you got an ABG in the ER? Oh, there's a guy, like the a one pulmonary procedure. guy that wants those, and so I can get them, but you're right. Not very there, there is a proce one procedure that used to haunt me and still does ABG? as a resident was getting the radial art line. Remember we have to used to do that for the map and blah, blah, yep, blah. Yep, Even yep. the ABG, I'm like, you miss it and it spasms up and blah, blah, blah. I was like, I can't remember the last time I got an ABG. Now, they are very helpful, remember, in critically ill patients and ARDS. So you're real Hypoxic, sick people. Yeah. Thankfully, we're now doing more and more femoral art lines. They're kind of coming back because I feel like everyone stopped doing ABGs for a while because it was just so difficult yeah. and took so much time and traumas. Like people are like, we don't have time to be futzing around. I remember that. Now they're doing femoral lines. You had to, like, so, yeah. you had to, you had yep. to designate a person to sort of uh, do it in Cebu, if you yep. remember. Like you sort of have somebody that all they were doing is getting bumped around with a little needle, getting the ABG and bump, 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 bump. Awful. And that person was the last one to finish their procedure. They'd be yeah. like, the chest tubes would be in, intubated, pelvic binder on. They'd be like, I, I didn't get the ABG yet. I don't. So I think it, fam art lines will hopefully be helpful. But just remember, really sick patients. This yeah. is not everybody. And then your VBG is great for all the other stuff. The, exactly the right. metabolic derangements, yeah. the acid base stuff, it correlates very well. And those are like a dime a dozen. I That's mean, right. I get that on so many patients because it gets the calculated lights early, rules out DKA, bada bing, bada boom. So bada bing, if you want to know bing, more depth boom. about it, read this and then read the literature and then you can be really, really smart. But overall, if anybody who's uh, listening to this, anybody who's listening to this, they're probably not who's like grew up in the 80s like I did. There used to be a commercial uh, where, about an encyclopedia and they'd be like, did you know that the uh, the African racehorse upside down kick uh, toad jumps over the, and they're like, no, I didn't. Like, Can you tell me more about it? And he goes, read the book. That's what, that was the thing. <laughs> We're read the article. Uh, did, yeah. <laughs> that didn't work. All right, I'm, I'm leaving. That's terrible. I got to back out of this.